as well. The Mishkan was the place where the Shekhinah resided. Where you could feel the Shekhinah. What you were supposed to do is to take this, 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 the, the, the Shekhinah, this energy with you and, and, and uh, take it back home or take it back to, to your life. And this is uh, the end. It says, important point, the Mishkan and the Bet HaMikdash are not God's home. Rather, they were divinely designed uh, to teach how we can bring God, God home to us. So the idea also of a Bet HaKnesset, of a synagogue, is not a place that you go, right? And you have there, you pray for an hour, two hours, whatever it is, and then you go back home and that's it. Not that at all. The idea of a Bet HaKnesset, of a synagogue, is, is a place where you come, you take the Torah out, you read from it, and so on and so forth. But it's up to us to take it with us. And this is what it says in the Pasuk, Veshachanti Vetocham. I will reside in them. It doesn't say betocho. It doesn't say in it, in the Mishkan. But rather betocham, in which each one of Am Israel, of Bnei Israel. The idea is that even though God got to the point of Tzimtzum, the idea of Tzimtzum is to take the place where God, in a sense, condensed himself, his presence, but to take it with us. You can't leave it there. If you leave it there, it, that's not the point of HaKadosh Baruch Hu. The Torah is here in the Bet HaKneset. We keep it hidden, concealed. But when we take it out, it's for us to take this energy from the Sefer Torah to our own lives. And this is the idea of the Mishkan, this is the idea of the Bet HaMikdash, this is the idea of, 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 of a Bet HaKneset, of, of, of a synagogue. And this, this is the, again, coming back, just to conclude, the machloket between the Ramban and Rashi, how exactly did, did, did it happen? There's two different um, um, approaches to it, but um, the fact is, it seems, and I could relate a little bit more to, to the Ramban, Nachmanites, the fact is, God understood that we needed something that is palpable, that we could touch, that we could feel, in order for us to be able to connect to Him, and again, to take this energy with us to our own homes, and to our own lives. Laila Tov. Laila Tov. Leo.